My name is Jacob Byers. I'm a driver out of Westland, Michigan. I've been working at Daniels for 15 years. My daily tasks are pre-trip inspections in the morning, routing out my stops, loading up my truck, making sure I make it to all the stops, finish my route, and make sure everything's complete as it can be. Going over my paperwork, make sure everything's correct before I turn it in, and uh, reporting with Dave at the end of the day, just make sure everything went well. My name is Mitchell Bell. I'm a driver at Walton, Kentucky. I take clean transporters and clean RMW up to a transport station in Indianapolis. And then from there, I pick up everything they pick up to bring back to Walton, Kentucky. And then they take it from there. The thing I love about being a driver at Daniels is the freedom on the road, uh, being able to make my own decisions, route out my route as I see fit, as long as you're getting your daily tasks done and then uh, really building the relationships with the customers while we're on the road. Uh, my favorite part is the actual driving part. I get to sit back, just listen to my podcast for a two-hour drive up to Indianapolis and then a two-hour drive back. I just get to, it's, it's my own comfort area, just driving the truck on the road. So my name is Brian Castro and I've been driving for Daniels about four months. And it feels like a family member over here, man. Everybody take care of each other. We have great communication with each other. So I just go ahead, do the route, do everything that I need. and. Man, I, I guess I was born to drive, man. I like it, I enjoy it. I stay here because it's basically just become a big family over the years. Uh, you get to build those relationships with people and you see them sometimes more than you do your own family. It's just one big uh, group here. <laughs> and I would say it will be a great opportunity. You know, it will be a great, it's a great career, CDO driver, and it's a good company to work for, man. So it will be a great opportunity if you ever get inside here, man.